Over the past 20 years, Little Rock's Water Reclamation Authority has invested $500 million to reduce sewage backups and improve the sewer system for residents all across the capital city. And now they're celebrating their success. Channel 7's Ashley Butler joins us live from our newsroom now with more on that. Ashley. Chris, LRWRA successfully reduced 339 sanitary sewer overflow locations across the city of Little Rock. Adams Fields uh, is the oldest facility for the state of Arkansas and one of the largest wastewater facility in the state of Arkansas. The Little Rock Water Reclamation Authority say they have invested millions over the last two decades. We have brought in innovative technology that allows us not only to treat the water on a normal daily flow using the biology, but also have introduced a parallel treatment scheme where when it rains, uh, well, it did, it was raining. Uh, so when it rains, we're actually able to bring in a lot of that uh, the diluted water, be able to treat it very effectively, very fast, uh, and be able to disinfect and discharge to the Arkansas River. Those improvements are helping nearly 70,000 homes and businesses and more than 1,400 miles of public sewer lines. Through rate increases approved by city leaders, we were able to make necessary improvements of our collection system, the pipes underground, um, to our pump stations. We have about 34 across the city, as well as to our treatment plant infrastructure, including here at Adams Field Water Reclamation Facility. Thousands of service lines have been replaced and 105,000 can the grease kits distributed to residents to reduce the impact of grease on the sewer collection system, among other improvements. We opted to go with a more innovative UV disinfection uh, as a form of, of, of disinfecting the water before we discharge it. Um, as far as other technologies that we brought in, uh, high efficiency blowers, like I was saying, power consumption at a wastewater plant, roughly 40% to 50% of an electric bill at a plant, and it's substantial. Block says these changes will better serve the community in hopes that these improvements will lead to a more sustainable future. It took um, a lot of work and, and persistent focus on all the areas of our entire water reclamation process that we could, um, you know, focus our efforts and make any necessary changes. And so here we are 20 years later, um, having been successful in reducing or eliminating those SSOs in the city. According to the Little Rock Water Reclamation Authority, the water they release is at least seven times cleaner than the water in the Arkansas River. On your side in the newsroom, I'm Ashley Butler. We're certainly glad for that. Ashley, thank you very much. All of this is a result of what's called Project Renew.